Hi guys, so two of my batteries are dead. And um, yeah, I was just saying that I bought this new case for the new iPhone on Amazon. So that's what it looks like. You know, the hole for the new camera or whatever. Really simple. I always have um, simple cases like this one. So this one I'm going to send back to um, T-Mobile because I use their jump program, which means that when I'm halfway in my payments, I could get a new one and then I send this one back in. So I'm going to send this back and get the new phone. The new phone is coming tomorrow. I checked earlier and it said that it's going to be delivered tomorrow. So I'm super excited about that. But um, I just ran some errands today. Today is my day off. Went to Jamaica Avenue with one of my classmates and she didn't find anything. So I just went on the next bus and came home to the package that I just got. I had some mangoes down there. They were super good. But um, yeah, I don't know what I'm going to be doing today because now that our aunt is here, she does not want me cooking she wants to cook and i'm not complaining because when she's not here then i have to do all the cooking so i'm taking the breaks so i think i'm gonna go lay down because this morning i kind of woke up early i'm gonna go lay in bed watch some videos and really just relax really just relax for a little bit what is wrong with this fly i haven't really vlogged since she's been here because you know mad awkward talking to a camera and whatever so i'm just like all right i guess i could wait <laughs> So I have an early vlog, but today she's on the road. Jolie wanted me to go to Jamaica Ave with her today, which I did. And I bought a purse at Marshall's. And here's why I love it. A pocketbook, rather. And a heat protector because now that I flat ironed my hair, I need to, you know, have it protected. Also got the new phone. Love it. The camera quality is amazing. So why I love this bag is because it's three, it's a three in one set. It says Isabella handbag and of course I bought it at Marshalls. So this is the bigger one and I could take this to work with me every day and I paid $39.99. So pretty much $43 in total for all of them. I love this one because this one is like my little cross and take it out of the bag. So here are the two. This one has the long strap. It has these tiny straps, all right? And then it has this long one that you could wear like that too. And then of course, there is this bigger one, which is the one I'm gonna be taking to work with me because it's big and spacious. I could fit my lunch dish inside of here so I don't have to bring mad bags with me. And the small one kind of reminds me of this cute little one that I have that I had bought at Marshall's, you know, small. This one obviously is a little bit bigger, but still small enough where you can throw little knickknacks in there and, you know, be out. And then this tiny little, pretty much one that you just take with you wear on your arm like that. So I love that. And like I said, I paid like $40 for three which i feel like is a good price for three so tomorrow my co-workers want to go and have a drink so i'm wondering what i'm actually going to wear to work tomorrow i need to see what the temperature is going to be i need to try my wig on tonight to see if i want to wear the wig tomorrow or whatever let me see what the temperature is going to be so i bought this wig at work that i also really want to try on look at my hang time <laughs> anyways we're not going to talk about that right now so much easier to deal with when it's straightened than when it's um, not. And I'm going to buy this brush type thing on Amazon that... Uh, what is that on my camera? I don't know what that is, but I'm going to buy this bow dryer type brush on Amazon so I can try my... To straighten my hair on my own. I don't know what this thing is, but... Hello? So I decided that I wanted to test out vlogging on the new phone and I feel like so far the quality is good. I look like a bum right now, a damn toenail if you ask me. I don't know what I'm going to do with my hair tomorrow. My coworkers want to hang out after work. What am I going to do with this hair? 
that's gonna look and stay presentable all day so that we can um go out in the night i don't know because just now i tried on other wigs too and i did not like how she looked on me so i'd have to go on the long one and the truth is i'm not really in the mood for that either so i'm really in shambles i really um i don't know what to do however i know that tomorrow i'm going to do a little bit to my face so i'm gonna put some um pressed powder on and do my brows and stuff and i'm gonna take the pressed powder with me so that i can like re up on my face and stuff in the evening and maybe i should also take the um what is it called maybe i should also take the eyebrow penciling stuff with me too so i'll see what i do about that in the morning but for right now i'm about to brush my teeth change my clothes and go lay down guys i am proud to say that today i went and i did my certified nursing assistant exam and i passed so your girl is a certified nursing assistant how dope is that what's funny is the day when i went to register i wore this very same shirt down there boy i've never been happier to just finally be done because even though i was done going to the classes i still had to be studying to make sure that i passed the exam which the exam the written part of it was you know a breeze i mean i'm still not so sure about the clinicals but i think i passed and this also brings me to people who do not speak english as their first language they really struggle because i feel like the girl who i was partnered with you know she was trying her best but she you could tell that she didn't know what she was doing and i don't know and most of them too most of them who came from that particular school they spoke a different language as their first language and i don't know if it's that their instructor wasn't good or if it was that they did not understand what was being taught but one of them passed and i passed you know but everybody else failed and they were like all the things on here are things we've never seen but most of the questions were common sense so you could have been able to answer them so i feel like you know they're struggling just because their um their primary language isn't english and you know this is done in english and i felt so bad for them because to have paid your money to go to school and then to have paid your money to do the exam and fail is not it's not what you're looking forward to. I'm really glad that I passed. I was studying and I always made sure that I went out of my way to retain the information and whatever. But um, I'm really happy. I did partial bed bath and I did poles and range of motion, which love that for me. So um, yeah, I'm done waiting to get my certificate. My friends said they're going to email me and stuff. But right now I just went to the grocery store and I got to unpack the groceries that is the death of the death of me i don't think that's something i favor so much because it's always so much things to put away anyways i haven't had coffee in a couple of days and i feel like i've been spiraling so i made sure that i bought my creamer just now so that the rest of the week i could have some good coffee especially in the mornings I need it. I really need it. I honestly do. I'm 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 in such a better mood. I do better. I feel better. I'm just a better person when I have coffee in the morning. I'm not groggy. I'm not loopy. I'm you know, I'm good. Anyways, I'm about to go into the kitchen right now. I'm not gonna cook today because or aunt cooked. So I don't have to do that. But um I do have to put away the groceries because I don't want her to come back and you know there are groceries in there to put away, so gonna go do that and I'm, i really feel like i want to i want to get a quick little nap in but right now it's three o'clock and if i sleep now what time am i gonna sleep later to wake up and so it look like it's not gonna happen so i'm gonna just chill and stuff my mom is calling so i'm gonna go